Hey guys, how are you? Uh, how's it going? Welcome to another stream of NSIG, where we're this time gonna try out a couple of challenges that you have, well, told me during my campaigns of Germany and Japan. So, one of them is one I pretty much seem, well, probably, that's probably gonna be kind of impossible. Italy, ni 1945. It's not gonna end well. Yeah, like, I don't know what more to say with this, but one thing you've also told me is Italy 44 and Italy 43. But you also wanted me to see Finland for some reason, so, yeah. So, well, each of these nations will die very, very quickly. So I decided to do, well, this, a stream where we will test both of them. We're gonna play as Finland and as Italy. So my setup from the beginning, um, by the way, hello uh, Yukira, hello Enflet, hello Sayad, hello Mikkel, hello Warm, hello Sion, hello um, 420, hello Ben, hello Sajat, hello Hedian, hello Kim, hello John, hello Ex Alexander, Eddie, Ola, Musian, and well, uh, many, many, many more. Uh, let's see. So yeah, my setup. I'm gonna say hi to more people quite soon. Hello, Ice Lord. Uh, we are gonna play as first Italy, 1945. Then, if we fail, which we are going to, we're gonna play as Finland, 1945, which we will probably fail quite quickly as as well, if I imagine. And then we're gonna jump back into hello, Christian, Chrisander, very welcome right there. Hello, Ice Lord again. Apparently, I said hi to you twice now. Uh, so yeah, Italy, Finland, Italy 44, and if we still fail, Italy 43. So that's kind of my setup. So as we begin, Italy 1945, let's go. <clears throat> God, this is not gonna go well. Hello, Conor, hello, hello, <laughs> Adolf, hello, Justin, hello. Uh, Nala, hello, Anti, hello, hello, hello. So I'm done. I want full NC experience. I have those fancy gaming PPCs, when, which I really, really do not have. Okay. So what's the situation with Italy? We are a puppet to Germany. We are at war with, well, we're at war with them with two fronts. We barely have any land left. We have mostly German troops, if any, defending our land. We have in total three lovely divisions. <laughs> Oh my god, this is so bad. <laughs> uh, let's see, uh, we're gonna get as many factories as we possibly can get on weapons, well, which means seven factories, we're just gonna cancel the rest. We just need weapons, weapons, weapons. Actually, let's get six factories on weapons and then one on rations. Awesome. Uh, let's see, oh god, we haven't done anything right here. Yeah, it's like Italy 1945 is really not one of those nations you're supposed to play. Uh, so, I, I don't know how much planning we can actually do to be able to survive this. I am gonna take my troops, I'm gonna put them... Actually, let's see, that's not the best place to defend. This is a better place to defend. Sure, we lose most of our... F actually, we will lose most of our land and factories right there. And here, well, that's also a pretty good area. But, well, we can't do anything in the west, so I guess we do stuff in the east. Um, let's see. What's the cheapest piece of crap division we can possibly get? Um, division color, uh, yeah, you, hello, welcome to the army, if I, well, I hope, I want to get two of those divisions, we can deploy right there and right there, and, um, yeah, we'll just have to wait and see if we might be able to do anything, Me Mexico is a next, no surprise right there, and that's just something that always happens, let's see, so we're gonna do military factories right there, <coughs> right, 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 need to open, so, it's the 23rd of well, December, um, me and my family, we always have some Christmas celebration already today. Just this tiny thing before we celebrate the full thing tomorrow. We always have some Christmas ham and the lovely thing we have in Sweden called Julmust. So, um, yeah, what is it? Hello, News Source 7. It's kind of like Coke, but... Um, Special. <laughs> I don't really know what to say. So I was just thinking, let's crack it open right now. Don't, don't, don't blow up. Nice, nice. God. And I, I bought a glass bottle just for this occasion. Otherwise, plastic bottles, but cheers. Ah, God, that's nice. Uh, is it alcoholic? No, it's not. Actually, this is non-alcoholic and it's like... 
mm, it's like so good it's so freaking great uh, <coughs> right uh, let's see so we are gonna set up some laws like even though pretty much well I expect all of you to already see it it's impossible to survive but I'm still gonna give it I'm gonna give it a valid try like I'm gonna do what I can to actually be able to play as optimally as possible we're still gonna give it our best attempt and we have two entrenchment guys oh god that's actually a very good start right there and artillery expert well that's a bit worse uh, let's see entrenchment genius are you kidding me we are gonna be so entrenched except I think I'm actually gonna pick the infantry we already have double speed if it was how much entrenchment sure but since it's only entrenchment speed I'm gonna pick the infantry genius right there uh, we have a bunch of manpower we are losing manpower though so uh, I well we're gonna die before that happens uh, this might maybe help me so let's boost that up propaganda press that's the correct one limited exports let's see law and government do have anything right there uh, might help me in some way shape or form let's see anything else Oh, uh, I don't think so. Not anything that might help us, at least. Okay, I guess this is it, really. Uh, ground support... Actually, do we have any airplanes at all? We actually do. Wow, we have 156 fighters. That's awesome. Hello, uh... Let's see. That should be... Hello, Anti. Hello, Cyan. Hello, Daria Play. My boy! No, well, I don't know if I'm your boy, but um, I, I am your YouTuber for now this evening, and I hope you will enjoy this show. <laughs> no theories, oh my god, yeah, you're worthless right there. Uh, but one thing we can pick right there, and is... Let's actually make our tiny amount of fighters a tiny bit better. Uh, do we have any kind of navy? No, we don't, so I guess this is everything we can and will do. Let's just get some converse up here and rolling. Research, well, we can actually get a couple of things right here. I doubt we're gonna finish any one of them, but um, let's let's just see what happens. And let's just go up right there. So, war begins, war, no war exhaustion. Yeah, that's, that's a good thing. Uh, it seems to be only Germany of many nations that have it. Uh, let's see, you guys are, well, just get down right there. Uh, we're gonna get, actually get high pri priority on actually getting my units out, because we need more units. We desperately need more units. <clears throat> One thing I would call this a victory is if we manage to survive a longer time than Germany, then I would like to call it a victory. Actually, we can just do like this. Because it will probably take them a while to push in from the east rather than the south so if we just keep one unit right there and have this guy being placed right there then we have our entire front like well defended right there and if we get one additional unit okay god damn it we want two units anyway because if we have it right there and right there we have an incomplete circle right here that should well make it hmm no, 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 I do want to keep that province. Yeah, I do want to keep that province. So, yeah, we need two more units right there and right there. And we might be able to do something. Uh, if you spam D to split your air wing, you'll get a bunch of one play, which will give a ton of aces. Oh, yeah, yeah, I know. I know the, those abuses. But usually when I play pen, I'm sure I will use abuses. Definitely. But will I use abuses that are way too good? No. Will I use exploits that will uh, well actually exploits that most of you don't actually know about no um i i usually try to play the game as legit as possible you know i the exploits i will use are n very known exploits or stuff that most people will use or discover very quickly i know several things that completely breaks the game but i'm not gonna do that stuff <clears throat> It's called cheating. Oh, yeah, of course. I can use to annex all and boom, done. But yeah, that's not fun. Uh, let's see. Germany is trying to help me. Ah, that's brave. God, I'm playing NC right here. That's crazy. Um, Justin Pierce, thank you so much for this support. Hitler is dead. Keep Milan. Well, I'm gonna try. I'm gonna try to keep holding as much as I possibly can. Uh, I c oh, do you mean... Well, that will stretch my front line a tiny bit. Though it would give me all of these factories. And depending on how long they actually actually will take for them pushing from the east, it might actually be advantageous to just do like that, as you're saying, Justin. Well, it all depends on if I get these units out in time, which I very much doubt. 
<coughs> we'll have to see. We'll have to see. I'm gonna try. I'm gonna try with your wish, but um, well, don't expect it to actually work. Uh, emergency war bones. That sounds great. Uh, let's get some war propaganda. Uh, I don't know. Emergency factory. Actually, yeah. Why not? Yeah. Yeah. Definitely. Emergency factory conversion. Getting us five more factories right there. Uh, where are my five more factories? Come on. It was supposed to be five more, right? Or did we just get factories because of trade and we didn't have that many? Maybe? Huh. Uh, let's see. Do we need anything? Yes, we need both. Wow, wow, wow. We need steel and stuff. Oh. Uh, Germany, please give me the steel. Whatever steel you have. Yeah, that sounds very nice. Uh, yeah, let's try to group this together and see. <clears throat> you are a puppet. Yeah, I know, I know. Uh, if you win, I'll donate Justin. Um, if you donate ten thousand dollars, then uh, you know I can win by just cheating. You didn't actually put any restrictions to your message, and there we go. I'm dead because Germany falling. Hmm. Yeah. This, this playing as Italy won't work because of that puppet thing. <clears throat> Well, at least I will say I survived longer time than Germany. Everything I did was absolutely for nothing. We never shot, we never fired a single bullet. I think. Come on, game. Really? Are you are you really gonna lag out and kill me? Come on, just just shug it. <laughs> Come on, game, load. So yeah, this kind of happened exactly what I was planning to. We did everything we could. Germany's just gonna fall above us and really game? Are you really gonna crash right now? Oh, you're really gonna crash right now. Actually, that doesn't work. Where's my watch? Right there. One second, one second. There we go. Yeah, shit's broke. No, nice timing. Nice timing right there. <laughs> so, yeah, we are just killed off right there. No problem right there. But yeah, as you can see, I don't have very much to say for. We currently just are puppet to Germany and get slaughtered right there. But you did want to see 1945 Finland, right? Or is it 1944 Finland? 45, 44 Finland? Uh, Finland 1944 uh, Let's see It's 44, okay, but which 44 <laughs> the early or late one? <laughs> uh, let's see maybe I can read we took uh, West took back all of France Belgium and now danger close to the right itself uh, Russia uh, are still quite far behind Early early okay cool <clears throat> late, late, late. Later is harder. But then, of course, I'm supposed to pick later. God damn it, guys. <laughs> early, early. Well, then, uh, later. If later is harder, then later we'll do it. <laughs> 1066, Finland. Well, we're not going to play CK2 right here, Christian. Maybe later, but not right now. So, Finland. 944, Finland. Or are we already have we already lost right now against South Union? Hmm. Uh, let's see. So we have. So as soon as I unpause, all of my units will disband. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, so I'm gonna take all my units and just um, 
late right there. Sorry, it's later. Well, this is the later start date and uh, it's the Lapland War. Okay, cool. So uh, we got a bunch of equipment right now, but we don't have any manpower. Uh, let's see, are we growing manpower right now? No. So we're going to go up to search by requirement. Uh, specialist training, please. Uh, propag oh, we can't go to propaganda press because, yeah, damn, that's bad. Uh, let's see, we need to be can't, we need to change something. Well, we'll see. <coughs> no, early. Are oh, you saying early? Try the other scenario. You're not fighting the USSR now. Okay, so with this, the early scenario. Like, um, I, I, did, I didn't want to do any research because I want you to see my original expression. I don't want to be that guy who have already everything planned out and know about everything, how I'm going to change it. I want to see, like, I want you to see everything from the very beginning. How I think, how I change, how I do everything. So that's why I don't research. But since I don't research, we, we have these issues. Well, we don't know what to do. And yes, there we go. This is when they are at war with Soviet Union. Boom. <laughs> wow. Wow, this is not good. Uh, let's see. Holy shit, this will end very, very badly. Uh, okay. Uh, yeah, uh, Finland, I, I know you are, like, wait, 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 uh, let's see, so, this is Finland, but yeah, this is Finland, so, um, I know you're super strong and super powerful, but, I doubt even you can stand against Soviet Union right now, but we'll have to we'll have to do it our best. We'll have to do our best. Ugh. So let's see. How are we looking? We have 160 manpower, we're dying, we don't have anything, we're gonna go search by requirement instantly. Basic training, no, we're gonna be specialist training. Uh, propaganda press we can't still do our average education effort mm. uh, war economy nothing right there so let's see entrenchment genius we might pick that uh, regrouping it oh, wow you have some really good guys right there okay um, army medicine wow um, large man thank you so much for the support merry almost Christmas merry almost Christmas to you too hmm So, from my, what I see right now, we're supposed to pick Artillery Genius, Army Regrouping Genius, and maybe even the Army Regrouping Expert as well. Just so we can constantly swift, well, shift out our units, so we constantly have the morale and enough power to actually stay in battle constantly. Okay, uh, let's see, Military Staff right here. Infantry Genius, that sounds lovely right there. Uh, because that gives 20% defense comparatively with that one. Manaheim. Oh, Manaheim. The Manaheim line. But we can't pick this guy. No. Wait, we could? Oh my god. The game tricked me. <laughs> I really thought we couldn't pick that guy because he had a great portrait. But yeah, we could. Uh, Carl Gustav Manaheim. Emil Manaheim. Oh, really? Father or son? Or? Huh? I don't know. Uh, we'll see. Uh, change politics to get Manaheim leader. Uh, what? Uh, we can change politics, proclaim Nordic unity. <coughs> uh, I don't know if we can change just anything instantly. Uh, we don't have any special focus tree to allow me to do anything like that. Uh, let's see. Uh, worker strikes pirates out of control. Um, <coughs> I don't think I want to do any of those. Uh, what I would like to do is I could get fascist support up and rolling so we can get some nice manpower right there. But otherwise, we can just have some more civilian factories and stuff like that. Heavy industrial power, uh, new rising resources issue, and yeah. <clears> hmm. <throat> uh, I have no clue what we get from any one of these, so we'll wait a tiny bit with that. Okay, let's pick some guys. Uh, we are gonna need. Oh wait, recover rate, justify war goal. Yes, please. Oh my god, that's just that is really good for me. Uh, division attrition. Uh, yes, please. Thank you. Hey, do do we have more guys? More guys that actually give good stuff for battling. Fortification manager, twenty freaking percent. Are you kidding me? 
Holy shit. Okay, I'm, I'm starting to get hopeful. That's dangerous. When I get hopeful, I get overconfident, and then I die. So, okay. Okay, I think I think it's time to actually start applying our fail counter over there. If I fail, then I will have to tick that one up. Okay, uh, let's see. What more can we do? For oh my god! Two of them? Yes, please. Uh, I don't freaking care if that's an issue or anything like that. We are gonna have both of them. Uh, let, oh god, we only have 800 military power left. Uh, hello, genius guy. Uh, I also want you, and I want the lovely other guy. Let's see. Calorie expert, yeah, that could be nice. Entrenchment genius, yeah. I might want... Yeah, I'm gonna keep you. Thank you. Uh, let's see. Free fortification engineers. Wait, really? I can't pick him. I can't pick him. Oh! <laughs> I can't pick him. Damn it. Uh, let's see. Uh, let's see. Uh, le uh, look at industrial symbols of Germany and then at yourself. Atlantic Wall. Yeah. Communist pressure. Yeah. Uh, basic indus industrial society. Uh, wh what are you looking for? <laughs> Industrial society because I'm German is better than me or <laughs> this is getting out of hand now. There's two of them <laughs> Oh my god, I love prequel memes. That's the best shit ever Okay, hello Soviet Union. So we have taken my fortifications right here And you will most likely take my fortifications right here as well Do we have any defensible position that I would like to take? Let's see Where's the land that I need to care about? Uh, all the land in the north is pretty much shit so we can ignore that all my men, let's see, that's some decent land. And there's some decent land, okay. If our front line is right there, uh, you can pass right there, right there, right there, um, right there. God, this is gonna be a pain. Right there, right there, and up that entire way. Uh, so what I'm imagining right now is we're gonna make a front line that looks like... Oh, right, we need to make extra order. Uh, let's see. Up there, we're gonna go in... No, wait, 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 wait. God, we're gonna have to do tons of small little front lines. Like... Actually, if we block that off, then we are done right there. Okay. So, we're blocking that off. Black, blocking that off completely. Right? Yeah, we are. Cool. And we would have the next guy right there. <laughs> uh, we would have guy and protects this. So, this would be our defensive old position. Let's see. Uh, they try to get in here, we have an army blocking them, they try to get up right here, army blocking. Uh, they swarm up right here, we have an army blocking them right there. They swarm up even further up, we block them right there. They try to get in here, army blocking, and blocking, blocking, blocking. Cool, okay. <coughs> uh, military factories, right there, right there, cool. And uh, national focus, right, this entire thing. Uh, I think I'm gonna... This is getting out of hand, now there's three of them! <laughs> Holy shit, that's 20% more. <laughs> I completely forgot about it. That's why you should never pick anything ahead of time. You might find another one if you just think a tiny bit more. <laughs> there we go. Uh, so, we're gonna get four levels up here. So, how quickly will it get... And well, how will it take to build a single one? Still 33 freaking days. I'm really hoping this is not actually counting with all my bonuses. Uh, it's counting with all my bonuses. Damn it! We need we need more civilian factories. That sucks. Well, at least we're gonna build something like this. I don't really care whatever we have. This is what we're at least gonna build. And uh, let's see, you guys gonna be on top. There we go. I think you, then you guys. Yeah, cool. Uh, so we're gonna take most of our divisions, like pretty much all of you. I'm gonna take one division up there. Uh, you three are gonna get right there and one unit right there. Then we're gonna take pretty much the rest of you right there. Move in right there. Thank you. Uh, research slots available. We're gonna get the next weapons right there and support weapons right there. Doctrine wise, can we pick anything right there? Ooh, that's actually 50%. Yeah, let's pick that one right well. Cool. Anything else? Free dockyards. Just give me all the convoys we have. Uh, most on weapons than on... Actually, wait, we do have equipment, or do we? We'll have to wait and see. Uh, anything else? You guys are getting down right there, but yeah, I'm gonna deploy you guys a slight bit like this. Uh, where else? You're gonna go up right there if you can. Do we actually have any kind of naval priority? Well, we'll see. 
<sighs> Do we have anything? Sweden, you pretty much have nothing kind of just fight against you. No, we need world tension 100% for that. Okay, uh... Can we do anything? Can we request stuff? Can we? No, I don't think so. Is there really not anything more we can do? War bonds? Yeah, sure, but that's... Uh, that's not really something that will help us very much. Uh, war... No, this is what we guess have to begin with, at least. Uh, let's do like this. Finland! Un pause. Finland, come on. No, no, not... No, I refuse. I refuse to have that as my freaking name. There, no proof. <laughs> Come on! There we go. Finland on pause. Uh, save seven divisions in the east on Late Lagoda. Um, right here? Uh, they are right now told to go right there. Why shouldn't I fall back with them? Uh, there we go. Five divisions up there. Actually, let's pick... Let's see. These two and just move up right there. That would probably be useful. So, let's go to speed four and we'll begin like that. So, everyone is basically just falling back right now. Regrouping, do whatever's necessary to fix that. What's my plan? Build up, build up, build up, and then we're gonna strike back. Uh, Milta Theorist uh, isn't really useful for me right now. And God, Finland has two of them. <laughs> everything is getting out of hand. They have two of everything. So while you guys are fighting right here just to hold the freaking ground, we'll see if well, the rest of you guys can fall back. Fall back! Fall back! They're broken through! Castle is breach. Retreat. Retreat. Hurry, come on. Let's get into the inside. Uh, let's see. There we go. We are falling back right there. You guys are rushing forward right there. Cool. You're gonna get up right there. We're building this up. We're getting manpower. Uh, let's see. Anything else we can do right now? No, not really. Okay, let's see. So, what I'm also doing right now, I'm extending the Soviet lines, and that might give me a small shot in hell to actually help, well, to actually maybe help Soviet Union or Germany a tiny bit. By pulling more forces to the north, Germany might have a shot at actually, well, defending. Uh, you're rushing back right there. Okay, I'm just going to forcibly tell everyone to go to where they should be. Because otherwise they might get caught by some stupid reason like this guy. Oh my god, I, I love I love the Finnish voices because I know who made the Finnish voices. He's an awesome guy. Uh, there we go. We have fallen back enough. Call the arms from Bulgaria. Yeah, we're just gonna say no to everything for now. Uh, look out for the Soviet air reinforcements. Uh, they will destroy my forts. Yeah, I know, I know, but we can't really do anything about it. We just have to accept where we are right now. Uh, we actually have weapons and rations right now, but they're reinforcing, so we'll have to wait and see a bit. <laughs> a cappella, a cappella. <laughs> uh, generals, oh my god, I <laughs> didn't even get general right now. Uh, let's see, oh god, none of them actually have their proper stats set up. Uh, I'm gonna promote this guy. Yeah. And that's pretty good, but I'm also gonna get up a field marshal. So I'm going to promote this guy as well and get him up right there. Yes, so we get slightly better bonuses right there. Okay, how does everything else look? So we're still alive. One good thing at least. Uh, no, I'm not going to join any freaking war that you might have. Who, who, who do you want to call me in against? I don't really know, but for now we're just going to sit here and relax for a short while. And try to, well, try to defend... Blah, be defend properly. Actually, what... As Finns probably know, offense is the best defense. If I could actually get in right here and cut them off, it would be nice just as a, my own victory to grab Leningrad. But okay, now I doubt it's actually going to happen. This guy is actually having a very hard piece of time right there. We'll see. Uh, there we go. Romania declares war on... Oh, God. Now people are going to start turning... Well, people are turning against Germany right now. We'll have to wait and see. 
So we're defending right there. We have units properly stationed everywhere right there, yeah. And we even have Germany that is actually properly placing their units in my fallback lines, which I'm very surprised over. Let's see. This guy, he's gonna have these two provinces to fight against. Okay, so yeah, it's good that we have three divisions. But I'm mostly worried about these two. You don't even have one fort level up right now because they're constantly being attacked right there. Even with all my lovely bonuses right there. Mm. Annoying. Uh, if we got war bonds, would that help me at all? No, it wouldn't. God, I don't know. I don't freaking know what we're supposed to do. We'll have to wait and see. Rip manpower. Yeah, I know, I know. I can clearly see it. Ugh. But we can't really do anything right now. We just have to accept it. We have to accept it and wait for a prime opportunity to advance. Hakka pele, hakka pele. Let's go. Leningrad, Leningrad, Leningrad. Oh, no, 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 no. You are gonna delay that guy. We, If we manage to grab Leningrad, I will call this a victory. So come on, come on. Get out right there. Get out right there. Ah, ba, 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 damn it. You actually caught me right there. But that's actually a fortified province right now. Hmm. Uh, stop attacking right there. That's just plain out stupid. Uh, nope, nope. This won't happen. This won't bloody happen. God damn it. Hey, disband the navy. Yeah, that's actually a lovely idea. Let's disband that. And 4,000 manpower. Nice. Uh, we have 250 fighters as well. That's 5k manpower. But they won't be as useful. Well, they won't be as bad right now. So much for the Leroy Jenkins charge. Yeah, exactly. Come on, let's just get back right there and defend your properly pro uh, proper province. Okay, so Soviet Union are pulling back with more and more forces. Germany, they are dying very, very, well, very heavily. Damn it, that sucks. Hmm. At least try to survive longer than Germany. Then that's a pretty good victory, I think. So you are being killed off right there. We're going to have to take one unit up there. You are not even being attacked right here for some reason. So I'm actually going to pull away with two forces right there. Uh, please strategically deploy to this province. And then you can move in right there. Thank you. That's why I got all the reinforcement guys. That are going to well bump up your reinforcement rate quicker. Uh, let's see. Okay. Leningrad one more time. Leroy Jenkins. <laughs> come on, come on. Let's do this. <claps> up, up, up. Nope. <laughs> Damn it. <laughs> Instantly broke my dreams right there. Mod the tactics used with great result. No, you're gonna stand your freaking ground right there. Uh, we're gonna do long stand stuff. Yes. No, already. Yeah, we're gonna do long stand stuff already. Uh, we need... Oh my god, Germany is just sending so many troops to my front line. God damn it, Germany. You're not supposed to do that. You are supposed to actually properly defend your own stuff and not help me. But, um, well, if your help helps me outlive you, I will still call it a victory. Uh, okay, are you just pulling more and more forces away from me? No, nope. there we go. You're now attacking me with your full strength. Uh, this will probably not go very well. We'll have to defend that one properly right now, but we don't have more forces to pull on. Uh, this guy is gonna do pretty goddamn excellently. Hello, give me one of these guys, and you'll actually have to full pull back, please. And strategic redeploy right there. So strategic redeploy right there. And then you're gonna walk in right there. Cool. Uh, anything else we can do right now? Plot on Hitler fails. Oh, um, in the Führer bunker. Ah, right. So he's probably gonna slaughter a couple people right now. We're probably gonna have to follow follow up event about well, uh, Operation Valkyrie. There we go. Took me some time to figure that out. Uh, let's see. Do we have any air forces over me? No. But if I assign my air force to get air force, will he assign something to counteract me? For now, nothing, so I'll just grace, gracefully, gracefully accept that and we'll see. And here we go, you're attacking me on a full on scale right now. God damn it. So, Union, I was hoping for you to give me a tiny bit more time. Just a tiny bit more. Or we'll actually have to fall back even further. Let's see. That's one province. That's one, two, three, four, five, six. That's many, well many fewer provinces right there and we should still keep most of our factories so we might actually want to fall back right there like these two can be united into one pile right there 
Hmm. Actually, this one would be even better because then you're only available to be attacked from one place. Okay, yeah. So I'm gonna take these two guys. Let's see. Oh, what are we losing? We're losing more manpower, of course. We are definitely losing more manpower, but we can definitely fall. Okay, let, let's at least draw out the plans for now. You're gonna be. Come on, you're right there. We are gonna have one. Uh, well, one river province right there, but that's good enough. Uh, that guy, and then let's see. We would have. No, that's too much. That's way too much. Uh, let's see. No. Right there, right there, and right there. That's three provinces instead of... Ooh, that's nice. But we don't have a river right here. We have forest, forest, and forest. No surprise, it's freaking Finland. And that's basically the same except we have a river thing as well. We could, of course, extend that one by one, two provinces, but that kind of breaks the entire point. Well, we're not going to fall back right yet. Definitely not. But we're, we're going to see. We, we might we always have a reserve plan. Always have a reserve plan. Always have somewhere where you can fall back to, at least in all of these mods. So we're trying, really, really trying to build up these forts right now, but it's, it's going to see. No retreat. Well, that's Stalin tactic. We are actually Finland, so we're going to try to win. Uh, okay, let's go to speed 5 again and see what happens. Uh, Germany trying to push, are you crazy? So Soviet Union is constantly pulling away. Uh, the Warsaw Uprising uh, of a single Soviet division. Polish militia. Simulated as a... Wow. That's maybe not correct. <laughs> uh, let's see. Let's let's just ignore it for now. Uh, Germany, what? The so bad AI. So I just said it had pretty good AI because it put units at my fallback lines. It's also negative since it put stuff when I don't want them. Hmm. Uh, can you start a civil war in Russia? No, and I would never do such a thing either, because that's just a plain out cheat tactic. Okay, we are definitely going to need more troops at other places. So we're going to have to pull back from here. Uh, let's see, right there is a very desperate point right now. So come on, chop, chop, get over right there. Five divisions right there. I doubt it's going to be enough, but we need we need troops out of, at other places. Uh, oh God, all of these places are desperately falling now quite quickly as well. Uh, let's see, how much manpower have we killed off? 21,000, Soviet Union have lost 23, so we are barely killing more than they're killing us. And that's actually more desperate than this area. Uh, but you're being attacked by more people, so let's send you guys right there. Uh, we're barely holding this place right now, okay. Well, like I said, I went into them, well, mindfulness that we're gonna lose this. Up, 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 there we go. You fell. You fell, that means a complete fallback. It's time to fall back. I don't care what you guys say. It's time to fall back. Retreat! Retreat! Cancel all of these lovely fort buildings and let's try to get up them right here. Uh, you first and then you, 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 you. Okay, then we're gonna do everything. Well, just pull everything back. Uh, let's see. Who are you? Okay, you're the one that we're supposed to be on top. There we go. Uh, let's see. All of you guys, get back right there. Cancel these. Right there. They have broken through. The castle is free. Retreat. Uh, you four guys right there. All of you guys get down right there. Let's actually take one troop right there. So three troops right there. These two guys right there. And these ten right there. So everyone just time to fall back. Uh, Rit uh, Risto Rutter resigns. Mr. Rutter, our president, have announced that he will resign following the new Soviet offensive which had pushed back and broken through uh, Karelian Istush. His successor will be none other Carl Gustav Emil Mannenheim, who is determined to seek alternative rather than continue this war. We have no chance of winning. I don't... Weak! Weak, you bastard! Okay, no, you, you are still brave, but the other guy that's going to replace you is a weakling. A traitor! Because we are falling back. We are not retreating. We are not giving up. We are not going to give up an inch of land. <laughs> you make me watch two towers again. <laughs> Sorry, Various. <laughs> 
that is one like one of the best movies that have been, ever been made. I dare you to change my mind. Uh, so you guys need to fall back before the other guys. Otherwise, there we go. Uh, you strategic redeploy right there. Now you guys can strategic redeploy right there. Uh, those three guys get back right there. You get up right there. And now you two strategic redeploy right there. And uh, you get back like this. Uh, come on. Shop, shop, get over there quicker, please. Uh, extended edition, I hope. Oh, of course, of course. The two tower have the best extended editions that, well, there is. Especially the one with Boromir shouting, like, The city of Oskeliath has been reclaimed. For Gondor! And then you guys write in the chat, For Gondor! Then I say, For Gondor! Then you write, For Gondor again. Are you ready? Okay. Uh, Oskeliath was once a UOLR kingdom. Uh, a place of life and beauty and music. And so it shall be once more. And then you shout like, Wah! Uh, let the armies of Mordor know this. Never again will the land of my people fall into enemy hands. Ah, this city of Osgiliath has been reclaimed for Gondor. Nice. For Gondor. For Gondor. Ah. And now let's end that shit. Uh, <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> God, YouTubers have too much power. <laughs> it's horrible. I love it. Okay, everyone, guys, just fall back right now and actually properly defend this. And we'll see. Get back. <laughs> uh, let's see. <laughs> For Sparta. <laughs> Come on, guys. Just f fall back right now. <laughs> For Rome, for yeah, we see about it for Saint Petersburg, for that Return of the King, not that, not for Gondor, for Finland, <laughs> for the Shire. <laughs> okay, so we're falling back right now. One more extra step. Moscow armistice. So the war for Finland has not been kind. Although we regained much of our land annexing the Winter War by the Soviet Union, the tide has turned against. Although we have regained much of our land, much of our land annexed in the Winter War. I don't know which map you are looking at, but I, I think we're looking at different maps right here. Uh, <laughs> Winter War by Soviet Union has turned against us and it's before too late. We should sign an armistice to stop the fighting or end up like Germany's. Other allies invaded by communists with a puppet Bolshevish government installed against the people's will. It's time to put an end to this war. We'll keep fighting. We'll keep fighting until the day we die. Daniel is doing worse than his sork of Finland. Well, in real life you wouldn't fall back like this. And I'm actually, I actually have a shot at actually defending this properly. Uh, I'm need to take a couple of units right there. Let's say three divisions right there and pull up right there. Because, well, we're def definitely going to need more forces up right there. Uh, so guys, just chop chop, get over right there. <coughs> better, red, better dead than red. Okay. You guys are getting back right here, cool. How's actually Italy doing right now? Yeah, they're doing decently. They only have three divisions still, which kind of sucks, but um, they're holding the ground. Uh, may maybe that could actually be something you can play with. Germany's actually pushed up right here, right? Oh my god, really? Uh, but they're still failing dealing with the D-Day invasion right there, so we'll have to wait and see. Uh, let's see, so we are defending right here. Do we have proper garrison orders right here? Uh, well, you are gaining your entrenchment as quickly as you possibly can, but um, maybe I should have had a couple more entrenchment experts because you definitely don't have your full entrenchment right there. Though it would take 34 days, so we'd probably be down at, at minimum 25, so that would still not be enough to actually properly defend this. Damn it. Build more units. Well, we don't have manpower for that. I would love to build more units right there, but we don't have any manpower. We're just trying to preserve every single piece of manpower we have by every, like... Okay, we're killed off many more than they have right now. How many men are we actually missing? We're missing 6,000 men. We could disband our entire air force to, well, properly 
uh, almost regain everything we need. Though currently they don't have any kind of air force assigned over Finland, which gives me full superiority, and that gives me some nice bonuses. Or is it they who get negatives? Uh, I am always wrong with this. You, you're getting negative. Right, enemy air superiority, right there, breakthrough, minus 20%, yeah, that's lovely. That's really good. Uh, okay, you guys are defending this, yes, cool. Uh, do we have anything that you can pick? Uh, like defensive doctrine, that would be lovely. And let's see, adaptable, even better, winter expert. Wow, holy shit, we had so many things we could pick right there. Uh, this could probably have saved us a bit more. Uh, let's see, damage reduction against cast air superiority bonus in combat. Do we get any kind of bonus ourselves for that, actually? Air superiority, air superiority, air superiority, no, nothing at all. Because that was us, right? No, that's Germany. Oh, well, well, some of these troops are mine. Uh, let's just double check again, just in case then. I don't see any, okay, cool. Then we are definitely gonna get this because, well, it actually says from Cass, you idiot. So yeah, we're definitely gonna get Camouflage Expert. Defense and Drocklin won't do anything because that's a Field Marshal trait, so that won't do anything. We get the Winter Expert, definitely, and that's pretty good. Thank you. So that's gonna help us a bit more. Nice, uh, let's see. Uh, they were historically over 530,000 Finns at the front. Uh, at the same time during the continuation war. Why only 130,000 men? I don't know. Tell that to the mod creators. Tell that to NSIG and you have the current... Well, actually with with 500,000 men, that I could have done something with that. I could definitely have done something with that. That's like... How much more? That's yeah, uh, four times the amount of troops I have right now. I could definitely have done that. You must. Yeah, I know. Werner Hansen. That's awesome. Add uh, 500,000 manpower. Well, I could actually do that, no problem. Though, then I would like to do that from the beginning again. Like, I will... I will restart the scenario, but I will add 500,000 troops. And then I should kind of... Yeah, even the Winter War, the peak was 350,000. When will you finish this campaign? Well, I will finish the campaign once I die. Uh, let's see, we need more troops at north, northern front right now. So let's send over one guy right there. Come on, shop shop, get over there. One, two, one, two, one, two. Get up right there. You must, yeah, you must. It's kind of like cope, but not really. You can build entrenchment, cheaper than forts. Well, I also I do all of my extra guys help for fort. Um, that's 20%, 20%, and this is 20%. Nothing that helps for... I think I actually might go faster for me to just build bunkers still. Just because we have all of the bonuses. And they're m less easily being destroyed by them. But right now we have no civilian factories. We have absolutely nothing. We we just have to defend with what we got. Sardom of Bulgaria has fallen. Well... We're also probably gonna fall at any moment right now. We are just losing more and more territory. Uh, where's our next defensive line? Because this this has fallen right now, I think. We'll have to extend our front line right now. And as soon as you have to extend it, when you defend, then you pretty, mu pretty much know that you're dead. But yeah, everyone, just fall back one more province. Fall back. Come on, stop attacking. Stop attacking. Fall back. Come on, quicker. Just fall the, hell, uh, fall the hell back right now. And do last stand tactics right now. Just defend with for the... Well, last man, <laughs> really. Last man standing, come on. Uh, get in with two units. Actually, one unit and one cavalry unit right there. Defend right there. Uh, let's see, we're defending right there properly. Cool. Ugh, we are dying there. We are definitely dying right there. Fall back around Helsinki. Yeah, we're probably gonna do something like that, but for now let, Let's just give it a bit more. Well, we could get one there one there one there, but these are bad promises That's at least a forest we get one two three four uh, Five five provinces right there. Then we have these two one two 
Yeah, we have to have that one. Three, four, five. Or one, two, three, four. That sounds better. So if we take all of these guys and deploy just like this. Yeah, let's do that now. Let's do it. We we have lost the north. We are... Oh, well, we haven't lost the north fully just yet. We are gonna lose it. So it's better that we fall back right now while we still have a shot at setting up something proper after this. So you guys just get the hell down right there and defend this. I actually found a place online where I can buy Yulmus here in the States. Ooh, nice. Buy some. Yulmus is awesome. Well, I, I would say like this. If you like coffee, then you'll probably like Yulmus. Like, you must has some kind of... Charist like, some kind of aftertaste that's some somehow familiar with coffee, I think. In in my opinion. There are tons of different kinds of Yulmus, some that actually taste very much like coffee. But, I would say, if you like if you like coffee, then you most likely will like Yulmus as well. <sighs> Alright, you guys have lost defense, that's why you can't fall back right now. Daniel, weren't we doing Japan? We are probably going to do some Japan as well. But later, I wanted to do a proper attempt at, uh, well, at Finland and Italy first. We might do Japan tomorrow, though. So, on Christmas. But yeah, we might do some streaming tomorrow as well. It became, well, a bit too much stuff to do today, so... I might have to do another stream tomorrow, but I don't think you'll complain about it. So about like two hours right now, defending, trying to survive as Finland and Italy. And then tomorrow, we're gonna probably play some Japan. Uh, Julmust is inferior to glorious Norwegian Jule Bruce. <laughs> oh my god. Jule Bruce, come on. Even your name of stuff is ridiculous. Have some proper names, god damn it. Use your PP. Well, I can't really use it for anything. Not anything that will be useful for me. Oh. I don't know. Uh, something has capitulated. I'm not sure what. <laughs> okay, there we go. We're properly defending this line. You guys are getting up. Oh my god, what the hell happened right here? Oh shit, we actually were pushed back right there. Oh my god, you're kidding me, really? Uh, that means we are gonna have to defend those three provinces, please. And that means we are pretty much dead right now. Uh, come on, get up right there. Hurry the hell up. Split up all of these units. Get up right there. Free division in each and every province. Thank you. Let's see if you can get some defensive power from that. Uh, do we have any more equipment? No, we're starting to lack equipment as well to everything else. We don't have any fact. Actually, we do have two factories, civilian factories, right here. Nice. Uh, Germany is very soon falling. Come on, let me let me survive a longer time than <laughs> Germany right now. Let me survive a long time in Germany, and I will call this a freaking win. Uh, the 1980s scenario: and play as white Russia, and you try to beat Soviet. Well, we'll see. Uh, what happened to Indonesia? Well, I don't know what's happening in Indonesia. Japan owns it all, so nothing special right there. Play 1914 as Luxembourg. <laughs> uh, just joined and not looking good, Daniel. No, well, this is a scenario where you're not supposed to survive. I'm just trying to see if there is a way to survive from this. Uh, more defense, more breakthrough. Yeah, that's pretty good. Uh, let's see. So we are probably defending this right now. Let's just get some lost stand up and rolling. We're not going to have to, well, delay our use of it at all let's just use as much as possible for whenever we can let's throw in a bunch of units right there because well we need it and yeah, we might actually surrender before they get our capital no actually wait that's a lot of points so yeah we're probably probably gonna survive until they actually grab our capital that's nice uh but god you are damn it you're p too strong right now uh, update my generals. Well, I don't know if they have anything more that I could actually pick. Like, I could pick this one, but it's not gonna apply since it's a field marshal trait. Not applying until... So, yeah, nothing right there. And these guys, well, I've already fixed that, so nothing right there. Don't play a speed 5. Well, it don't really matter right now if I'm playing a speed 5 or not. Since, well, we are dead or we are very dead. Uh, let's send over one more troop right there.
You're trying to push out right there, Germany. Yeah, that's not gonna work very well. Please, come on. Let me survive for a longer time. Disband the planes. Well, I don't know if that's something I want to do. Ugh, because they're right now providing me a 20% negative right now for the enemy. A 20% negative for their uh, breakthrough value right now, which is pretty good. We have... that's that's helping us quite a bit. 5,000 manpower. I don't know how much that would actually help us right now. Uh, let's see. We could take this cavalry unit. Just disband that one. That would be another... Yeah, that's like... That's 2k right there. You're gonna last longer than Germany. Yeah, I, 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 I hope so. I hope so. Come on. Let's just properly defend this. Uh, let's throw up one more guy right there. That's gonna be hard to defend. Let's... Get up one guy right there. We have some German troops right there, so we're gonna throw up you two right there. Cool. Come on, just get this up and rolling. Let's defend that properly. Oh my god, you're so close to losing right there. <laughs> we're basically throwing in everything we have right there. Uh, let's take two of these guys and just move up as far as you can. These two guys are gonna get in right there and hopefully defending that. God freaking damn it, we are dying. We're dying. Uh, you missed the. Uh, you missed where I said not. Wait, what? You're not gonna last longer than Germany. God damn it! I was reading what I wanted to hear. Up, up, up! There we go. We lost that province. So we are just gonna reorganize everything right now because right now our units are dying because they don't have enough equipment. They're dying because they're well defending until the very last freaking. Ugh. Uh, let's do like this. No, 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 we should still properly hold this. That's a couple of provinces. We can still fall back a couple of provinces right here and there. I hate that I actually disbanded my navy right now. We might be... No, we... Oh, actually, we might be been able to actually use my navy right now to naval invade something. Damn it. I should have disbanded it. Yeah, I know, for the manpower and stuff like that. But right now, it could have been, it could have been useful. Let's see, how are you doing right now? Uh, let's see, you, my dear, and Air Force are going to be taken at any moment. Now it's time to, to disband this and get us some more manpower right now. Uh, fall back to Mars. <laughs> Tantua, you're in the USSR. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, yeah. Ah, come on. Come on. Come on. Soviet Union, just move in right there. Move in. T take Berlin. Turk, take Berlin right now. Just, just let, let me hold out. Let me hold out longer than they. Come on, come on, come on. Come, just get in right there. Come on, come on, come on. We can do this. We can do this. Just defend Helsinki a bit longer. Come on. There we go. <laughs> uh, actually, wow. Let's see. Uh, Hitler's dead. Don't new Führer says we'll fight on. Wehrmacht ordered to maintain discipline. Wow, really? That was that was Heather. Don't I thought you don't I thought you were a pretty guy, nice guy. Donitz, 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 Donitz. God damn it! How was it that you pronounced his name? Well, whatever. Uh, let's just fall back right now. Every single force I have back to Helsinki. It's time to defend our capital and nothing more. Donitz. Naval Commander Donitz. I think that was it. Yeah. Uh, come on, just everyone. Uh, there we go. All of our troops are now falling back. Slowly but steadily. Weird mustache guy died. Yeah, uh, yeah, he's pretty weird, that guy. Donitz. Yeah, Donitz. Cool. Uh, okay, build Fort Hill Helsinki. Well, I don't have any civilian factory. Well, I have one civilian factory. I doubt it's actually gonna have time to do anything right now. Admiral Donuts. <laughs> That's just mean. Come on, fall back right now. Yeah, I think I'm gonna lose. Well, we, we survived a bit longer at least. We survived, Hitler died, but we, well, Hitler died, at least. We survived longer than Hitler. It's time to do last stands until we die. Every single troop from Finland is gonna fight till the very last end right now. 
I'm sad to say it, but yeah, we're gonna do it. There we go, that should help me a tiny bit at least. <laughs> Actually, let's boost it up to the very last end. We're basically gonna have just a couple of seven days. There we go, we just stacked it a tiny bit right there. That should help us. Yeah, it helps us a tiny bit right there. Command ability bonus plus 160%. Uh, switch every unit to a single template, try to consolidate them in and try again. Actually, that might actually be something that might help. Uh, let's see, we remove that guy, we remove... We do something like this, then we do everything to that guy. And consolidation is not possible until they are active. Come on, just beat that back one second. Nope. That was just a plane out dead instantly. You can come back from this. Well, I doubt so. And there we go. Hmm. Okay. So, uh, what do you want? You want me to try... I could try one more time as Finland. But add with the historical numbers, so I will give myself uh, 400,000 manpower. Or I try Italy with uh, the 1944 early start date. So, um, yeah. Finland, Italy. Wow, there's a lot of support for both of the things. But I, I think I feel... I think it looks like a tiny bit more Italy, to be honest. Shane side and joined Axis. Okay, uh, we're gonna do like this. I'm gonna try one more time. I'm gonna do one... Well, I'm gonna take Italy right now. Uh, with the early start date. 44 start date, not 33. 44 shortage are still, still, well, it's still supposed to be pretty goddamn hard and pretty much goddamn impossible to survive. So, we'll do that. If I fail one more time, we'll go back to Finland with manpower. So, early 44 start date, let's join in right there and we'll see. 1918 Austria. Well, I've already done 1918 as Germany and we survived quite well right there. Uh, so, Italy. Oof, we have only lost half our nation right there. That's a bad first step. But hopefully we can focus on the southern border. God, I wish I had one of those fancy gaming pieces. Uh, let's get to like this. Let's get my troops up there rolling. Let's see, we have man... Don't we have manpower? Uh, yes, we have manpower, but we're losing manpower. We are, well, demobilizing right now. Uh, basic training, well, you're supposed to have specialist training... Propaganda press, that's good at least. Uh, war economy, we can, no, we're not going to do anything right there. Uh, let's just stay where we are right now. Uh, entrenchment, entrenchment, artillery, uh, infantry expert. Well, I guess we're going to do pretty much the same thing we did before. Uh, well, get all three of these guys, no matter what. Let's see, nothing right here. Uh, crime fighter, hmm, pretty good actually. Uh, no, nothing. Actually, yes, let's get that. No, wait, no, that's the wrong one. Um, okay, we don't really have anything special right now. Too bad. Uh, we are 100% fascist, so that should be fine. Let's just get our normal stuff right there. Uh, we need to get up a higher military industry. So, is there anything that gives us higher uh, military building power? Uh, no, actually not. Only freaking civilian factories. But I guess that's better than nothing for now. Industrial research, get some infantry research, and then we're gonna save 200 points for something that might come up. Uh, we're gonna get industrial effort right there, get us some more civilian factories right here. We're gonna get more military factories built in Lombardy because that should be pretty goddamn safe. Do we have more civilians, really? No. Uh, military factories, we have, well, everything is gonna go to Germany right now as soon as we unpause or do anything right there, so that's too bad. 
We're just gonna expand everything right there. You're gonna be down on one factory. We're gonna get one factory right there. You're gonna get one right there. Thank you. Uh, you could be upgraded right now, but I'm not gonna upgrade you because I need that. Or actually, are we gonna upgrade it? Yeah, I think we're actually gonna upgrade it. Never mind. Uh, so everyone up right there. We're putting troops right there. South. Uh, we're gonna go in right there, get the modern support weapons. Don't unpause just yet. Actually, let's have, have it on one. That should just give us some extra time. Come on, guys, fix this. Curses. Uh, the store I found online closes after the holidays. No Yulmus for me. Oh, damn it, Ice Lord. Too bad. Fi fail count, boy. Uh, pff, yeah, actually, that should be counted as fail count. Damn it. That should definitely be counted as fail count. The one Italy we did first, well, it's impossible to survive. But Finland, maybe. Maybe. Maybe there would be some way where you can fall back. Yeah, I think you need to be one of those, have those one of those super lucky times where it's like one in a million for you to survive. And then you need one of those one in a million times where the AI freaks out. And you might be able to survive, but I don't know. It would be extremely, extremely hard. Let's see, anything right here? Nothing I want to do right now. Let's see. It would be nice if we could be somehow become more independent. Um, actually, we should maybe have done something else. Fourth reset slot. Our country is industrial compared with Europeans. Oh, nice. Really? Okay, I won't complain. Let's just get this one up and rolling. Uh, let's see. So we are going to focus very much on s the south right now. We need to reclaim Rome. Uh, do we have any kind of air force? Any kind of air force? Please tell me. Yes, we do. Uh, what do you have right there? We have more troops, so we're gonna get actually our air force right there. We're gonna get air superiority, and let's see if we can do anything right there. You are getting up right here. Actually, I'm gonna split this into two stacks. It's 200 each. Thank you. Uh, we're gonna get uh, more ground crews, so he boosted up a tiny bit more, and hopefully this will help us enough. On the road that will lead us to Rome, the way. Way won't be easy, it was take us to hardship and pain. Hell after hill, taking your chase on defense. Head up north. God damn it, don't sing, Daniel, don't sing. You can't sing, so so for the love of God, don't sing. Uh, move in right there, excellent. Let's see, can we go in and get Rome right now? Just reclaim Rome this quickly, that would be a good victory right there. There's a nice propaganda win right there. Uh, you do need to build fighters. Yeesh. Yes, I do need to build fighters, but can I afford it? Yeah, that's another thing. Uh, let's see, that's just early fighters. What kind of what kind of tech do we have right there with fighters? Oh god, that sucks. Improved fighters level two only. Uh, I guess it could be worth it to have one factor on it, but that's free a month. Nah, I don't think so. Let's just ban that cheap crap. Uh, Romania clears on Germany. Yeah, I know, I know, I know. Damn it, damn it, damn it. There we go. We click away right there. Uh, let's see. Okay, this probably won't work. Let's see if we can, in well, surround and kill off a couple of units. Oh, we actually got Rome. Just that I said, let's ignore it. We actually took Rome and... By we, I actually mean we. We were the first one in, which means, well, since you're gonna have mechanics and stuff like that, we gotta be, wait, we gotta be the one that actually did it. Nice. Uh, let's see, we need more troops. That's desperate. We desperately need more troops. Mm, okay. So now the other Italy is coming with their tanks against us. Oh my freaking god. Really? How do you afford tanks? That's cheating. Anything we can do, though. Well, we do have quite a bit of factories right there. We could go some emergency factory conversion. We'll get about two factories something because, well, we're puppet to Germany and stuff like that. So, sure, let's do it. Anyway, uh, we need those factories. Any factories we possibly might get. Two more factories right there. That's good. Uh, please just get me more troops. Every single troop that, well, I can get is going to be desperately good for me. How are you doing? Yeah, you're good enough. Let's get one artillery. No, we're not gonna get any artillery or anything like that. Just get me please two more troops or something. Uh, generals, both of them have generals. It's just they don't have a portrait right now, but I guess I could always upgrade them. Uh, you can get reinforce rate. Okay, you can get both of them, sure. And could you actually get something right there? Nope, so nothing right there. 
come on, Germany. Just, just give it back to me, please. Nope, you don't want to. I knew it. I knew it. Yeah, this is not gonna look good either. There's not a lot that I can actually do. I think it might be more interesting if I actually go back to Finland. Like, it, it, there would be a lot of wait. Uh, 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 there would be a lot of waiting time for me right here to properly do anything. I'm gonna give it a bit more time to see if anything works because here I can't do very much. I thought they had a bit more troops right now that could actually make a bigger difference, but um, yeah, it doesn't look like it. No fighters, any kind of navy. Nope. Hmm. We're, we can basically only hold our line right now and we will surely but steadily die. Just go Italy 19 for, uh, 1943. Yeah, I might have to do it, because right now there isn't very much I can do. It would be kind of boring of you see seeing me sitting here for a very long time, not really doing anything. I would basically only be sitting here, waiting. Waiting, waiting, and waiting. Waiting until something happens that might never happen. So I'm, I'm, I'm gonna look at the 1943 start date as Italy, and then we'll see. Let's see. Uh, the past year has been a disaster for Italy. Not only have we been pushed out of North Africa and other colon, uh, uh, colonies, but the Allies have just recently invaded Sicily and are now threatening to invade the mainland country with uh, bombing raids already causing panic and discontent with the war. It may be time to switch sides and get rid of Le Duce. Le Duce. Le Duce. Uh, no, nothing like that. We are going to defend this for the last freaking stand. Okay, there we go. There we go. That's an army. That's a freaking army. I want the full NC. I will have one of those fancy gaming PCs. Okay, let's see. We have an army. It's 1943. Germany is falling back in the east. And we desperately need to do something right here. Uh, the Allies have a massive freaking army right here. I don't like it. Well, we are going to do something very, very special. Very simple thing right there. Switch side and put your troops on German cities. Why in hell are we gonna switch sides? No, 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 no. We are not a traitor for the love of God. So all of you guys that are right here in the east. God, that's a lot of troops right here, to be honest. Uh, let's see, that's German troop, okay. So we're gonna take all of you guys in the very far east. Um, do we have anything important right there? Uh, well, that's German control right now. So yeah, we're gonna ignore that land. We are gonna Defend right here. All the cities and ports, please. Right there and right there. That's proper. That's nine divisions. Okay, can I defend more? Well, we're probably gonna do it, but we are gonna add more troops. Let's see. How much for defending all of Italy right now? That's gonna be 31 troops. Oh, God, that's a lot of forces. But if I could properly defend all of this, then I don't have to worry about a lot of stuff. So I'm gonna do it right now. We're gonna take just those three Mountaineer Divisions and do something else with you. Uh, I'm gonna sign a good Field Marshal and I'm gonna sign the best general I have right now. Which would be a level 1 guy right here with no, no more skills. Because he's level 4, he will take a long time to upgrade. Every single time I, he levels up, he get one stat in every one... Well, he get three randomly dealt out stats in these four different things so a level one guy would be best there we go and this guy well I guess I can just pick army leader well that level two guy he's sounds reasonable join in right there uh, every single guy that it's not assigned to anything right now you're gonna join up right there uh, I'm just gonna jump jump in right here and promote you to a field marshal thank you uh, okay all of you guys are gonna be deployed right there, I think. Because we're not gonna hold that main front line at all. And uh, nothing right here gives me any bonus, so we can just ignore it for now. And you guys are gonna split up right there for garrison order, that's lovely. Uh, stuff right here. Secret weapons, no, nothing right here. Uh, is anything destroyed, anything bombed? I don't know. So we'll wait a bit between construction repair and, well, not construction repair. Let's get some military factories up and rolling if 
well, if the case is that I can just build stuff. Mm, tech right here. Yes, please. Yes, please. Uh, yes, please. And yes, please. There we go. Yeah, I know. Accidentally selected wrong one right there. And uh, let's see operations. Yeah, sure. We can just go down right there. Cool. All right. Uh, these guys up and rolling. Let's just get down right here and prepare something proper right now. Uh, you guys have fallen back right there. Happy holidays, guys. Happy holiday. Uh, let's see. You guys are... Yeah, you're gonna get crushed right there. Let's see. Where's my Air Force? We actually have a kind of nice Air Force right now. Uh, let's send everyone to the south. And then we'll see what we can do with it. We're gonna grab our entire fleet right there. Properly just throw it in right there. Everyone, please be on do not engage. So we don't lose any part of it. Thank you. And just get over right there. Uh, 1756 Aztec Empire well I don't know about that and then we get a bunch of random events that gives us some stat bonuses sure whatever uh, crap we forgot about this entire thing uh, better equipment please more of it get the support ignore the tanks ignore not ignore the motorized uh, we need some fuel we need some rations as well please come on what the hell are you doing why, why don't you have any rations uh, let's see, let's get three factories on that because we're missing quite a bit of that. Wow. Yeah, three factories on that, one on fuel, that should be enough. Uh, improved fighters, sure, but we're only gonna fix improved fighters, nothing else like that. And then we're gonna get five factories on artillery. Well, more artillery later, but for now. <laughs> and the same with anti tank, please, and anti air. Cool. Take Sicily. Well, I don't know. Uh, switch side. No, I'm not going to switch any side. Infantry expert right there. Yeah, sure, but don't we have anything else? No, not yet. Uh, we could go to total mobilization, but we don't have enough blue power right now to do it properly. Uh, censored press. We should definitely be on propaganda press. Wow, we have so many things we need to do with our blue power right now. Uh, do we have like a workhorse or something like that? Uh, I don't see one. Damn it, so we can't even get more blue power that way. I guess we're not gonna pick any natural focus then for now. If we don't pick any natural focus, then we're gonna get more 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 power and we can pick different things right there. Okay. Uh, so we are gonna get infantry expert. Nah, nah, it's better to pick something proper. If you don't take uh what? If we don't take what? What shit do you mean? Read the natural spirits. Italian incompetence. I don't see anything right here. Sicily. If I don't take Sicily, then it's all over. Are you saying? Wow, really? Okay, then we got to put. Oh, Palermo. Palermo, it's called. You said something with the I, so I was wondering. Uh, but holy shit, yeah, that's bad. Italian incompetence, minus 20% recovery rate and 15% organization. Wow, that's ridiculous how bad that modifier is. Uh, let's see, our entire Air Force is, Air Force is now stationed right here. Uh, let's see, what are we going to do? Close air support, naval bombers. Yeah, you guys are going to move over right, uh, right there and just, I don't know, protect that sea, I guess. The rest of you guys, you're gonna group up right there and be assigned right there. You're gonna do air support and close right there. We're gonna do more air crews to hopefully help us. And these guys are probably getting up right there. Thank you. Uh, let's see. So you're gonna are kind of moving out right now. We're gonna get a couple troops in every area right there. We're gonna support you with some motorized and some mountaineers. And these two guys get in right there. So, let's see. Can we break them on every any single spot right there? The southern front looks, well, most like something we can maybe do. So, the rest of you guys, just come on. The rest of you, just stop attacking while you continue the attack on the southern front with some extra support right now. Come on. Just break them right here in the southern front. Come on. Come on. We can do it. You guys can do force attack and force yourself through right there. But it would be better if you can just get down right there without doing it, please. 
Oh, that's a really harsh. That's a really harsh. Say hi to Berlin. What? What's hi to with Berlin? <laughs> what the hell are you guys talking about right now? Come on, just get all right there. Just get all right there. We are gonna go in right here and get the propaganda press up and rolling. Uh, just getting more recovery rate for our units then. Then that minus 15% organization, so boosting up the division recovery rate, that would be pretty good. Uh, let's see, come on, just bring down that last, last freaking US, UK tank, whatever it is. Uh, you will have until the 8th of September. Oh my god, that's not a lot of time. That's ridiculous. And of course, there's not even more units right there, so it's time to do some force attacking right now. Boosting up our stats a bit more right there. El Duche is no more. What happened with 8th of September? <laughs> so we are right now, well... Mussolini falls from power. Walter a power with his own Grand Council arrested upon leaving with meet with the King. Uh, Elusia have lost the war and have moved with Prime Minister. What surprising turn of events? Well... Not really. If you fail, then you fail. Put a troop in Berlin. Why, why am I supposed to put a... No. No. Like, if I don't get to be fascist, then there's no point. Like, that's the point of all my things. I'm not supposed to win. Just switch side and win war. Like, the point is to do something strange and weird and, like, fantastic. And one of the things could be actually surviving this. As Italy... As fascist, and then we're gonna do something proper. Uh, we have one Soviet troop right there. You, he's gonna die. Come on, just break through right here in one of the spots, and then we can continue this. There we go. Thank you. So that's now brought in. You're counterattacking right here, but we should be able to do it. Well, do something to counteract this. Thank you. Uh, we have 28 troops right here, just standing strong, waiting for wait, waiting for something to happen. We have an uh, air force that is waiting there. You are attacking right there, right there. Let's see, where can we counterattack? I don't think we can anywhere. Well, you guys can, of course, try to keep going right there now. <laughs> if I don't get to Oh my god. Damn it, Virius. Don't quote me on stuff like that. Only quote me on good stuff. Come on, more force attacking right now. Uh, what the hell, guy? What the hell are you guys doing? Get over right there. We need more troops on the front line. Uh, supply there is fine. So yeah, get over there, please. Uh, free civilian factories. Oh, we actually captured them more. Nice. Uh, let's get some more military factories built up right there. How are we doing right now? Hmm. Reasonable well. Reasonable well. One month. Yeah, it's quite tight on time right now, but we should be able to do it right now. I think so at least. Germany is supporting our back, and we are just pushing forward right here. Uh, you guys attack right there. Delay them. Delay them by any means necessary. Come on. Just get in right there and break them. Come on. We can do this. We're using five units just as a delaying force. Yeah, that's very harsh. Oh, damn it. You just assigned more troops right there. That sucks. Come on, just move out right there. Move out from there. Okay, there we go. Now you guys attack right there. You attack right there to delay. And hopefully we can break through right now. Ah, uh, you're attacking me right there. Let's take one Mountaineer. Come on, stop attacking. There, attack right there. Delay them. And now we won't be able to break there because we have too few troops. Ugh, that sucks. That really, really sucks. Uh, we, we really can't break that province. Are you kidding me? Wow, that sucks. Uh, let's use everything we have instead right there. If we break them right there and break them right there, we'll have this surrounded and it might work. Come on, let's do this right now. Two units right there. Uh, 31 days. 9th for September, yeah. I know, I know, I know. It's way little. And there we go. We don't have any more enough command power to do this. Come on, break that freaking tank right now. Come on, chop chop. There we go, thank you. Now you can attack from that side as well. It looks like it's going to fall. Well, I don't know. Attack right there. Uh, you eight guys, you need to move in right there. ASAP, strategic redeploy. We need to attack there from both sides at the same time. And hopefully get some kind of... So everyone just shuffle around. And get both down there. This is not gonna work, this is not gonna work, this is not gonna work. Put a troop in Berlin. No! I'm not gonna change sides, then there's no point. 
Like, I don't want to win this campaign by just bringing down Germany. That's not the point of my surviving NC campaigns. My surviving NC campaign is do the basically impossible. Everyone get down right here and move in right there. Oh, this is going to be so tight. This is going to be so freaking close. It's going to be very close. Come on, get in right here. Everyone shuffle around to the very front line. Let's see. So take some of these troops, move in right there. And the rest of you are going to attack right there. And we're going to do a force attack right now. So this is going to be super harsh against these units. But we're so close right here. Come on, they don't have much organization. Just f keep doing it somehow. Keep attacking, throw your lives away, just do something. Estimated four days. Yeah, that's not going to happen. It's going to be much more than four days, but... As soon as these guys start to fall back, then we can do something. But the problem is... I don't think they will in time. I don't think they will time. Shore bombardment. Shore bombardment is definitely something we can do. Holy shit, I forgot about it. Oh my god, I should have done that a long time ago. But uh, the enemy fleet might be too large right now. That's such a simple thing. But yeah, we should have done that a while ago. Even sacrificing our fleet if we have to. Uh, let's see. Let's get that guy up and rolling, please. Boris the third is dead. Okay, fine. Doesn't matter. Yeah, that's a nice extra negative they have right there. But yeah, these guys are dying right now. Throwing more forces right there. Everything we have, just get in right there. Come on. Come on, we're so freaking close. I can almost taste it. There we go, we have a green marker. We have a green marker. We have a green marker. Alert, alert, green mark. Never mind. Never mind. We have a couple more days. I'm going to do one last push. You're going to activate a field marshal plan. You're going to get some planning up in here. Come on. 17 per day. There we go. 17 bones. We're going to give it one more day of planning. And then we're going to strike in with everything we have for one last chance. There we go. That's some nice amount of <laughs> extra <laughs> planning bonus. 85, we have a big green marker right now. Attack right there, I don't care what you do. Sacrifice yourself in the name of something. Just get in right there and, well, hold on. Hold on for the love of God. Come on. Oh God, we are, we are way too close right now. No, no, we will. For... T if you just disappear right there, disappear from there and we might do it. Take a couple more troops and send in right there, just delay them more and more. Uh, I don't think we can do it, I don't think we can do it. Yeah, you assigned a crap ton more troops right there. If we actually made these guys fall, that would remove the supply from you. No, they wouldn't even remove your... It wouldn't even remove the supply right there. It wouldn't even remove the supply right there. We, well, if we brought them down... Maybe, maybe we could surround, we would surround that slightly better, but it wouldn't help. It wouldn't freaking help. I don't even know what happens in a couple days. You're shouting me, shouting to me as something big will happen, though I have no clue what happens. Ugh. Multiple combat, and there we go. Something happens right now, I don't know what. Italy gets divisions. Which Italy gets divisions? I mean, their Italy? Okay. Uh, let's take that guy from Rome and just put right there. Uh, Italian German technology rejected. It's time to move against Italy. Or it's time to move against Germany. Ah, okay. So that's what happens. Um, well, I'm not going to do anything like that. So, I need to move up my fail counter to 2. And let's see, 1st of September. Can we do something 
different from the 1st of September. I doubt it. I very much doubt it. Uh, I should have made a save. I should have made a save. Okay. No. Italy. You you are pretty good. Italy is a pretty fun target. We can of course go in here. Win down Germany. No. But I, I think the heroic tactic right here is Finland. Finland feels like the right one to do. Damn it. Damn it, Italy. Like, you can probably very much do it if you do with shore bombardment from the very beginning, pushing in every single province. It would actually work quite well. I think you can actually do it. It wouldn't be the hardest thing to do. And then you can maybe build up something and then start defending, helping against Soviet Union. And if you just manage to make Germany defend against Soviet Union, you will be able to do this quite easily. So I think th that one isn't too difficult. But I want to give it one more try right here with uh, Finland right now. Don't blame Italy, blame Daniel. Like always, always blame Daniel. If you don't know who to blame, blame Daniel. It's usually what happens. So, select country right here. So, I'm gonna check right now. So, if we take forward Wikipedia. Wiki, because, well, some of the cases, they can be helpful. So, uh, what is it? Uh, let's see. The Winter War, the second time. Let's see. During the first war... They had 300 to 340,000 men. And let's see. The second war they had. Uh, the Lapland War. Uh, Finland had... Let's see. I can't actually see. Sony Chat said they had about 500,000 men. It's this, the Moscow ar Armistice. Uh, let's see. Uh, Finland fighting on one side and, and the Soviet Union and United Kingdom on the other side. Ending in the Continuation War. Continuation War was a conflict through fought by Finland and Nazi Germany as co belligerents against the Soviet Union. So the Continuation War. That looks like the one I want. And Strength. Uh, let's see. 450,000 to 700,000 Finns. So that's weird. Right now, we as Finland have 121,000 men. That's not even close to the amount of troops we're supposed to have right here. 450,000 to 700,000 Finns. Uh, let's see. How many Finns died? 63,000. Soviet Union lost about 250,000. Again, wow, really? Soviet? Come on, Soviet. You, were you really, really just manpower? I think so. Holy shit. Yeah, holy shit, that's... Uh, uh, what's the manpower law at? Well, the manpower law right now is at extensive conscription. And right now, uh, since uh, conscription laws work in a way that you slowly mobilize it, it won't be possible for me to actually get any kind of armor right now that way. So what I will do is add manpower so I have 400,000 men. So the lowest kind of estimated amount that, um, well... They guessed that Finland had during that time. And then we'll go from there. So I'm done right there. I want full NSIG. I have those fancy gaming PCs. Uh, I still thought, I think my... F uh, will you play 1918 Austria Hunger after this? Nope, not this time. If anything, I'm going to go back to Japan. So we'll see. Um, tomorrow, I'm going to get... Tomorrow, I'm going to do a stream where we play as Japan well my Japanese NC campaign so if you want to see that it's gonna happen tomorrow in about 3 plus 10 in about 14 15 hours something like that so I'm gonna do the same thing right here this time I'm gonna get all my men 29 divisions uh, will I hold both of these provinces right now? No, we definitely won't. We will do very, very much, very, very similar right now. Uh, these 7,000 men, you are going to be dragged out. Let's see. Okay, first, let's do this properly. You right there. You right there. And then we had this line. 
I'm gonna take every single one over here. All of you seven troops over right there. We have seven troops right there. I'm gonna grab two of you right there. Two of you right there. I'm gonna take one of them split right there and the other one right there. And I'm gonna take this guy move up north. All of these guys get down right there, but I'm gonna grab one of you to move up right there. Thank you. We're gonna go in right here and see. So I wanna see what happens when we pick one of those heavy industry stuff. Uh, we're gonna go up right here, get that one. We're gonna get this one. And we are, of course, gonna get next infantry tech right there. Thank you. We're gonna build more military factories right there. Use navy. Well, we'll see. First, manpower. Let's see. Uh, manpower. What is it? 400,000, I write? Yeah, 400,000. Thank you. So that's additional. Oh, wait, wait. That's minus 1,000. Uh, like this. There we go, 300,000 manpower. So now we have 400,000 at least total. We don't have a... We don't have a army right now. Uh, we don't actually have the men out on the field, but this is some kind of compromise. Uh, let's see, don't cheat. Well, uh, Martinez, if you wanna see me try this without cheating, you will have to, well, watch a YouTube episode once it, well, once it pops forward. I did try, we held out for quite a long time, but it's pretty much impossible to get any kind of manpower because, well, Soviet units just keep attacking you. So that's why we're doing. How did Italy go? Well, the first Italy 1945, you slaughter. Italy 1944, wasn't in fun. 1943, I didn't know that you had to take this, so I lost a couple of days and I didn't optimize it. But Italy 1943, it would be, I think, quite simple to do. So I decided to let's do the one thing that most people shouted for and seem most excited for, which is Finland with me adding some manpower. So we actually have an army that they had during this war, which, well, they had 400,000 men to, f how many did I say? 400,000 to 700, 450,000 to 700,000 men. So I need another 50,000 or how many? No, I need another, what is it? Manpower, another 20. Can I count? I need another 30,000 men. There we go. Uh, so I'm putting the lowest possible amount they could have had. So we'll see. Hello, you're new to the channel. Welcome, Star Kid. You are very much welcome. So these 29 divisions are ready right now. We are going to promote one of these guys to Field Marshal. I think I want this guy. Actually, I don't know. Do you want US Field Marshal? Uh, no, we don't. We want the other guys Field Marshal. Okay, cool. Oh, well. We do want both as field marshals when I think about it, but who is actually supposed to be the field marshal is the other guy. This guy, you shall have an adaptable trait, you shall have winter expert, you should have uh, nothing else. You, please, have defensive doctrine, winter expert. So my guys are basically not going to be touched by winter. Uh, let's see, right here we're going to ignore that. I do would love to have that, but we'll see. I do have some equipment right now, which is lovely. I'm gonna use it for all that is worth right now, but we'll see. I'm gonna need some steel, I think. Uh, as well, as at least when the big game begins, we're gonna need some steel. Uh, let's see. Manpower-wise, we are gonna go up to service by requirement, I think. It would be nice to actually mobilize some men as well. So we're gonna get, uh, get less equipment, but still we need something more special. Uh, specialist training, please. Uh, we are gonna do, let's see, we had a bunch of cool stuff right there. Uh, calorie expert, uh, not yet. Armor logistics, actually let's get that one. Army regrouping, recovery rate. Actually that would probably be more useful, let's get that guy. And let's get even less attrition. Yeah. Oh god, if you can't pick that guy, okay. Uh, division regrouping, there. Thank you. Recovery rate, rec uh, recovery rate, cool. That's a lot of recovery rate right there. Uh, infantry genius, thank you. Uh, what else are we going to do right now? Uh, let's see, Catherine industry. We'll probably need a bit more industry. I'm like really hoping that we will be able to survive this now. Fortification expert, we are going to get the silent workhorse. We are going to get fortification engineer. Can we get the third one right now? Ugh, damn it. Too bad. Uh, let's see. That guy, and then we had the one there. Minus 10% attrition. So we have a lot less attrition right now. We have 
one guy right there minus attrition we have one guy less attrition right there so minus 18 percent attrition that's lovely all of you guys are gonna fall back right there i'm just gonna yeah cool everyone is falling back quite quickly right now please just do it correctly now just fall back and we'll see and um, we're actually gonna make a save right now so we'll see uh do this half of stalingrad Defensive line, yeah, I know, I know, people are defensive lining. Uh, let's see, war bonds, that won't be useful, at least not now. And we are gonna just, let's see, where was an annoying place to defend? Right there and right there. Let's begin with those forts and then we'll see. All of these guys should just do convoys, but yeah, I doubt I'm gonna get any actually. So you guys are retreating right now, very good. Come on, just retreat. Don't die, don't die right now, just retreat. Just retreat. Uh, we're gonna get these guys, no. These guys, no. These guys, yeah. A couple more units right here. How many more? There we go. So take that guy and remove one more. We're gonna get six more divisions. Get them out ASAP. Uh, would have been actually nice if we actually did training first. We'll see. Uh, hole in defense. Where? What? what where? That's those two. This one. That one. Damn it, that one. I forgot that one. Uh, let's see. I definitely forgot that one. Crap. Uh, let's see. Let's just get this guy and deploy right there. Then we'll see. I'm going to have to be creative now and s steal some units from everywhere. We might have to reshuffle exactly how it, this is going to look like, but we'll see. Uh, no, please come on just retreat from here. I don't want to see you all die right here before we can actually do something proper So people just fall back right now Fall back and we'll see flood the fields. We are we are not Netherlands. Come on Wow, that was incredibly loud right there That sound uh, let's do this right right Air Force Air Force Air Force come on come on all those modifiers get my air, air force up right here and actually properly defend this we are gonna do more ground crews we're gonna get our fleet here uh, let's just get a commander then and just assign right here if it does anything it does something if it doesn't do anything then it won't do anything uh, let's see it oh, actually gives us some well a tiny amount of vision right there and uh, that's pretty nice Let's see, can we actually push in right here and grab Leningrad from them? That would be very nice and very funny. Uh, nope, nope, let's not do that. Thank you. You're counterattacking, you're getting slaughtered, very good. People are falling back. Let's see, these six men, so you're gonna be deployed wherever I might need them, so we'll see. <sighs> What the hell are you talking about? I guess Gurn is pretty sexy. What the hell are you talking about right now in chat? Are you guys crazy? You guys say? Uh, well, maybe I shouldn't say anything like that. I was the one shouting about Boromir and saving Osgiliath. Okay, we're probably defending this now. Cool. Uh, six divisions right here. I think that might be a tiny bit too much. I will probably pull back with some forces right there. But for now, we're just going to poke them in the head right there. To annoy them a bit more. Pokey pokey. Having a nice time there with that multiple combat penalty, but now you're properly defending it, so let's stop. Uh, let's take two of these divisions, you send down right there. Actually, let's only take one. This guy, move up right there, and then we'll see. Everything is right there, very good. Okay, cool. Cool, things are now looking as they should be. Uh, let's make another save right there. Just a quick, are you planning some CK2 in the future, maybe some Holy Fury con content? Well, it would be very, very nice to actually play some CK2 again. I might do it some someday during the, over the holidays, but we'll see. I, I won't promise anything right now, because even though it's holiday, I mostly just want to sit on my ass and relax right now. i having so much stuff is going on right now. It's going to be so nice with some spare time. So I really just want to sit down and play some stuff, relax. If I want to stream, then I'm probably going to stream. If it's going to be CK2, well, I don't know. We'll see. 
Uh, swapping cavalry into normal infantry, maybe. Yeah, that could actually be something I do want to do. But that's missing 5,000 infantry, infantry equipment, 8,000 rations, and more stuff. We, we Soon enough, soon enough. Uh, maybe if we only actually did the cavalry right now. That could be used. Yeah, let's do that. Let's only do the cavalry right now. And hopefully we'll have enough for that. Uh, that's going to be top prior. Let's remove one more guy right there. And let's see if that's going to be enough. Yeah, that looks a bit better right now. We'll see. We'll see if that's enough. Give the generals a trait. I'm already done. I've given everything I do want to give them. Uh, are you major in access? If they die, do you get out of peace? Uh, I'm not a major in the access. Damn it. So, yeah, if they die, then, well, I will die. As well with them. So we just better hope that we can do something with Soviet Union and before Germany dies. Uh, let's see, you guys finish this one, please. Sigsu. God, that's such a good bonus. That's such a ridiculously good bonus. Would it would just be so nice actually to have Leningrad from just under their head. Uh, let's see, could we harass them some other way? Like some stupid ass invasion. The only thing, the only thing we can reach really is here, and I doubt we're gonna get anything good enough. And Leningrad is constantly defended, so we can't do anything right there. Uh, let's take three divisions right there. You see, we can push back, push them back a tiny bit, and then just fall back. Nope, nope, stop, stop, stop. Thank you. Just a tiny bit of harassment, then we're moving back. Tiny bit of harassment, then we're moving back again. These guys really need to get deployed ASAP. Oh my god, we should never have done anything. Uh, maybe we should go back from specialist training. But that's the one thing that gives us actually a nice organization right now. God, even with manpower, this might be a bit too hard. Well, I, it's not that weird that it's too hard. It's just, I, I would have been, I would really have liked to actually be able to defend this right now. I'm just questioning myself, what can I actually do better? What can I do more properly to do, uh, properly to defend or reinforce? I could fall back even more. Is Finland harder than harder than Germany? Uh, without adding manpower, definitely yes. Uh, definitely one hundred percent yes. Uh, is there any way to uh, make you into a major with console commands? Well, kind of ish. You but I have to add a bunch of well, bunch of factories and stuff like that, and that I don't want to do. So yeah, we'll have to fall back even more if we want to have any shot in hell about doing this. Uh, we need to use our resources more sparingly right now, and that's one thing we can't do. These two guys are gonna retreat. Well, everyone's gonna retreat right there. See, we, we would have to fall back something like this, ridiculously. Just really just... Let's see. I really don't want to do that stuff. But right now we're dying. We're just plain out dying. We can't do anything about this. I'm trying to find a way where... Some move is gonna help us. Uh, wow, we have actually been pushed back quite far in the north, and I didn't even notice it. And some guys right here in the middle just died. Because, yeah, we're supposed to be 28 units. Holy shit. Okay, we'll have to fall back quite far right now. I guess we're gonna do the first fallback line like we did before. Uh, so these guys are gonna get back right there those two units these guys are let's see which is the province This province no that province These two guys are gonna get in right there And then all the guys in the north well you well you're not that many anymore, but you were supposed to hold Which provinces were it? It was three provinces these three provinces Maybe if I actually go back and defend those from the very early beginning, this might work better. Yeah, I think I'm gonna have to do that. If anything happens, then I'll have to do it properly right now. So let's bump up the fail counter to number three. And we'll see if we can do something better right now. Damn it. 
Fall back more, fall back more, and see what happens. So this is kind of where we are right now. We're going to take these divisions. You're going to move up right there. Uh, let's add that division as well. Uh, we have these guys. You are going to fall back right there together with these two units. And then we're going to take all of you guys. You're going to kill that. And you're going to properly defend this place instead. Uh, let's actually take one unit more right there and one unit from there. Thank you. That's going to be 10 divisions. So yeah, all of you guys just keep falling back a bit more. And please delete that order. So yeah, we are falling back a bit more, losing more provinces. Who would have thought Finland was so hard to play? Well, of course they're hard to play. They're meeting a superpower and you have basically nothing to defend it with. So yeah, it's very hard to play. <laughs> uh, hello, uh, Mres Jaeger. How are you doing? Uh, let's see, just started watching, what is Italy part of the stream? Well, we tried playing as Italy in a couple of different diff difficult scenarios. Uh, 1945, you can't do it. 1944, well, yeah, not really. 1943, I think that would be very much possible and not the hardest thing ever, but it's not interesting enough. I if like playing it, I want to do something super difficult and this was the one thing like I want to do the survive scenarios in the stream and right now this is the uh, survive scenario I feel like is most most survivy rather than me just playing a session I will might I will probably do some kind of Italy 1943 maybe some episodes of it and see how well it goes or how badly it goes but a stream I, I want to do surviving stuff right now F thanks for doing this by the way yeah no problem I need to stream some stuff, and uh, well, this was a good idea. Uh, plot on Hitler fails, Warsaw Uprising. Yeah, the Warsaw Uprising, that is one Soviet division. Should probably be Polish. <laughs> uh, hello, welcome back, Ultra. Let's see, that's probably being defended, but yeah, we're we are losing right here in the south. We can't hold that for long enough. Uh, let's do some lost stand stats. And really, you're going in there, not where we actually need it. Oh my god. Uh, let's try to get a fort, up, a fort level up right there, but I doubt we're going to get it. And now you're even attacking me right here. Oh my god. Hakka belly! Dalima. That puts a. <laughs> yeah, just wanted to hear the voice command right there. <laughs> You're so much better in this. No, I'm not so much better in this. I'm I'm only decent on Hoy, to be honest. I'm only decent, but well, more forts with what factory count? It's basically just. But yeah, we don't have enough factories to do this. Let's see, is there anything I'm not thinking of? That's basically, I have to just go back one step and see, is there anything I'm missing right now? Is there anything I'm not doing? Is something? Is there something I'm screwing up with completely? Because I'm right now falling back. Uh, Finnish equivalent to 40 to 1. Well, 40 to 1, they probably have better chance right there. But is there something I'm missing? Something I'm not doing? I don't think so. So he turned. He, well, he surrenders right now. We get a bunch of extra blue power. Uh, I guess we can always do air superiority thing. We have our air force up here rolling, trying to defend this as much as possible. Uh, nice entrenchment. We do have nice entrenchment as much as possible. Don't use last stand. Use force attack. Why should I, shouldn't? If I use lost, uh, if you use force attack, well, we get more breakthrough. If I do lost stand, we get more defense and entrenchment. Mm. 
Uh, we actually have to do last stand right now. These guys are gonna defend till the very last guy right now. Which I think means, well, you're just gonna die right now. To be honest. You have really nice defensive stats right now, but there are just so many more than you. It's crazy. It simply doesn't work. There you go, you died right there. The force attack makes you lose equipment faster. Well, force defense does the same. Uh, let's see. Horsey room from power. Yeah, nothing weird. Yeah, we're simply gonna die once again. Is there anything I can fall back to after this that is better? You are good. That. I guess. But we're gonna have to wait and see. Uh, you guys remove whatever you have right here. You fall back right there. You fall back right there. Come on, chop chop. Let's see if we can actually fall back quick enough. All of you guys get down right here. As soon as well, as soon as you reach this province, we might have a shot. These guys, you are not being deployed quickly enough. Like we can't even get these five divisions. We would have to do something really desperate, like with minimal training, just to get them out ASAP. Come on, just get him trained enough, and then we can switch that manpower again. I guess we can always do stuff like stuff like that. You can build divisions and reinforce. Well, I need I need equipment to reinforce. That's the issue. We can either build or reinforce equipment right now. We m they might f they might exist one with like this perfect balance where you have enough troops so they won't attack, which means you can build more equipment, which means you might eventually in the future be able to attack. But right now, that, w that would need a lot of testing and a lot of time. Uh, with combat with 10 divisions are less equipment and cheaper to use desperately. Yeah, I guess that's true. Uh, come on, just get me one more percent right here and let me at least deploy these 10 guys. Or pff, 6 guys that I tried to get for such a long time. Uh, you f get throw in a bunch of units right there, please. And all of you, come on, chop chop, get these guys. One more day. That should be enough. 20%, there we go. We got six more units. Woo! <laughs> uh, let's see, you guys get thrown in right there. Get some divisions up right there. And some divisions shall join you up right there. Actually, right there. I think it's more proper. Uh, don't defend in playing grounds, defend in forest. Well, if I defend in not playing grounds right now, then we extend our front lines by crazy. Actually, right there we could do this, but not more than that. That's very true. So these, but yeah, actually that's two more provinces we have to defend there. But we can do, no, like that, no. Hmm. Can we somehow skip that province? No, not really. It's either four provinces or three provinces. Right now, I think units are more worth it than just a slight bonus in river, uh, in forests. If you attack me right there, train minus 20%, but yeah, remove my units would be a basically 50% reduction, so yeah. Uh, workers in the most industrial region have tried for high... What? So, this is a bad thing. Oh, industrial society. So this basically boosts up your level from basic industrial society to currently example for what Germany have. Industrial society. Ah, that explains it. Okay, now I know what what these does. What these focuses does. Okay, cool. I know that now. Well, that's useless. You shouldn't do it. Well, at least not as Finland. What the hell are you doing? Oh, God, you lost right there. That's why you're trying to do that. Yeah, that's not gonna work. Guys, just shuffle on right there. You guys shuffle right there. Uh, these five divisions, it might be time for you to fall back right now. You get, you made it, a good attempt right there to stand right there. Is it gonna work? Well, not really. 
uh, change military factories civilians to build forts, then rechange them. Well, you know, it takes a long time to change them to military factories slash civilian factories, so we won't be able to do that. So, just very quickly jump over right there. And brrr, there we go. And now let's just let's just do like this. One gathered front line right there. Where everyone can defend. And let's do it a bit equally. And then we can very sh easily shuffle around troops here and there. Ugh. Oh, God. Whew. My suffering is somehow always your enjoyment. But yeah. I think Italy and Finland is... Eric, I think you need to go home. I think you're drunk. Because what uh, what, what do you mean? Your computer. <laughs> it's my computer. Um, hi. Uh, let's see. Time for government in exile. Finland needs a place in the sun. <laughs> uh, let's see. What the hell are you talking with Ava all the time? Just constantly affairs with Ava. I have no clue what you're talking about. To be honest. Is it something about the Finnish leader or something like that? I have no clue. <laughs> Uh, let's see, you guys moving in right there, yeah. I don't think I can do this. I would need a lot more waiting time. Like, I would need... A lot more tries. It sucks. I was really thinking I could probably do this. I was really thinking I could be able to somehow defend against Finland in a somehow proper manner and then eventually push out. You kind of look like Boko and one. Well, really? All oh, right, w weren't he supposed to like post a picture at 100k subs or something? Have he pic posted a picture? He has one on two thousand subscribers, so we're supposed to do it. Hmm. Yeah, slowly but sadly, my units will just die now. There's not really anything I can do. Hmm. Uh, what's the first start date in Enzig? Maybe another couple years prep could help. Yeah, but that's that's the thing. Maybe maybe a couple more years could help, but then it's not really this last final stand desperation defense that I want to play. I want really us to play the very very bloody hardest mode. Otherwise, I can just play a normal hard mode. Best defending strategy is to attack. Well, I doubt it's gonna help when you're trying to attack basically a cement wall. Just running into something that constantly will kill you, will kill you. <laughs> so, <coughs> so some last minute defense right now in the last two provinces right here. Let's see what happens. How long can we survive this time? We actually survived a but like we survived better without the extra manpower we did it better without the extra manpower which means getting deploying those extra units actually harmed us more than it helped us because the units we had had less equipment interesting to know right there Well, it seems like you guys don't want me to give up right now. 
But I'm probably gonna come back to this someday later then. Right now, I think I'm actually going to give up. It was basically now... Yeah, basically two hours of me suffering here and there. And doing a couple of attempts here and there. But I'm gonna stream tomorrow. When I'm gonna continue my Japan campaign. Where we did, well, Japan 1945... We're gonna see how that goes and continue with that for about two hours tomorrow. And then we'll see if I come back to Finland and Italy. Well, at some other point. And what the hell is going on right now? Why are you crashing? Wow, that's so weird. You have a completely different zoom level than I currently see. I have my basically streaming software right here that shows me what you're seeing, and yeah, that's completely different from what I see. Huh, okay, wait, you also see some interface stuff in the bottom left corner, which I don't. Huh. German capitulation, oh really, that could be it. That could be it, but it feels weird, it feels too early. Uh, please look at your Discord DMs. Well, uh, let's see. Oh god, we actually have a couple of people writing me right now. Uh, something I don't understand. Uh, you decided to make a jingle. Oh, I might have to look that uh, look into that right now. Uh, let's see. And oh, that. And yep, yeah, there we go. Germany fell, but we at least survived longer than Germany this time. But anyway guys, I will have to, well, just quit right now. And we might jump into Finland another time. We might jump to Italy another time. But for now, I'm gonna go to bed, wake up tomorrow at Christmas morning, open some presents, and have some fun, and then stream some more. But anyway guys, hope you enjoyed this stream. That you like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you guys next time. Merry Christmas, Happy New Year, bye, and bye.